Yes, sir, yes, so all blues, all blues. Congratulations to uh, Chelsea Football Club for winning the 2021 UEFA Champions League. And I just see my jump on them as you be seen are waiting the trend now. Although this one will be sport channel, but congratulations to the blues, man. So in case you missed it now, this is the full highlights. Or maybe you watch them, but you watch them under pressure. You know, relax now and watch them. Uh, it was really exciting match. Football's ultimate showpiece. Phil Foden, the Chelsea players coming out for their warm-up prior to this tonight. They line up for their boyhood clubs in a Champions League final. And we're here talking about two young homegrown. You would never have imagined being here now, being the two men we're talking about before the game as a build-up. Expectations built on them since they were under 15s. The comparison to David Silva and Frank Lampard. Long in his mind or in his thought process, he makes a mistake, he moves straight on onto the other. Guardiola and Thomas Tuchel as we inch ever closer to kick off. Here. For Chelsea, Angolo Kante and Edward Mendy. Serious. What to just get out of the way of the camera? I, I thought we sounded quite smart. Uh, this, this, this is what creates the atmosphere. This is what creates the energy in the stadium. You can see. I was like, lucky enough to be at the Brighton game a couple of weeks ago, and it made me miss football. Five goals, just two remain. Can Thomas Tuchel banish? It? Great stuff. It's Manchester against Huge Gamble on the fact that he can control the game. It's it's going to be two seed an English winner tonight as Manchester City and Chelsea contest the absolutely everything. It's a walk they've dreamed of and a night they will never. But it's the absence of both holding midfielders that catches the eye. It's only the 76, and like City, 10 of the 11 started the second leg. So the whistle blows and the 20 side. It's the fourth meeting this season between John Stones for the first time. And Guardiola's been up against English opposition in all three Champions League finals. Chenko and a got men forward here, Chelsea. Havertz just able to keep it in and plays it. Thiago Silva just moved unfairly there. Fantastic to Sterling, is in behind them. Rhys James gets back. And Mending was there as well. Gets it back again from Malvern with a chance, a really good chance as well. And he missed his kick, and what a big moment that was. Sterling plays the ball in. Mares trying to find a way round Rhys James. And Golo Kante found himself in a great position. That's an excellent challenge, though. Well timed and well read. Looking for Werner. It works its way here to Mount. Chelsea might be in. Werner with a chance. Edison with a save. He could have had two already tonight, Timo Werner. That was a lovely flowing move from Chelsea. It was. And Havertz, who's in there for his height tonight. Now well, that's a good take. Tonight. And you have to say as well that. Bernardo Silva. Foden inside of him, De Bruyne wide of him. It's Kevin De Bruyne. And the skipper has Pilaqueta slid in to Werner. Rhys James. Flipped out to Rudiger. Previously, Avram Grant had taken him to the uh, final in 2008. And it's James who flicks it in. And Sterling wants to go round James. James isn't having it. Bowling for De Bruyne, De Bruyne for Foden! Across came Rudiger, and critically so. On Sterling, and Sterling is teasing Azpilicueta, and his shot cannons out towards Chilwell, who allows Mendy to collect. Conte, Havertz. Fantastic battle out between two English. Silva saw Chilwell, but so did Walker. Silva away from behind Foden. Go late and high. Wide on the other side. Conte has played in Kai Havertz. <sighs> what a terrifically clean tackle. That's a critical moment from Alexander Zinchenko. But tonight it wasn't meant to be. And Andres. Turned out by 
Chilwell floated towards Timo Werner. Looking in Kai Havertz, who is around Aderson, and Havertz scores for Chelsea! It's a royal blue moment! For the would-be Royals of Europe from London to... For a German coach, a German striker, capable of preserving a lead. And it's a game with it. As we head into... In by Conte, taken by Werner and scratched behind. If one of those two or both of those two are playing... There is always an ace. It's after. You know, they've created three chances uh, on top of the goal they've seen. In cup finals, the team who scored first went on to win it. Manchester City have scored two and only two. Free kick taken, you'd have to say, from nowhere near the offence. And then another chip on the Raheem Sterling. Foden plays it in, Conte's there to meet it. To all intents and purposes, the Fernando Silva. Walker, picked off with comfort by Edouard Mendy. Way by Diaz, Walker's a little uncertain, Stones is there to watch it. Bubbles, expert fireman, he's putting out... Boom. Entirely understandable reasons. Golo Conte, and when you speak to him about how... Do you... And what Werner has is pace, what he wants is the ball, and he's deprived of that by Ruben Diaz. Mm -hmm. Tuchel in charge in 2020. And Manchester City are losing here. No first-time finalist has won since Borussia Dortmund beat Juventus in Munich in 1997. Two goals. Flicked in by Ben Chilwell. His part, as indeed is Gabriel Jesus. This, of course, is going to add time. One that really has taken us. In by Gundogan. Out by Jorginho. Struck into the crowd by Sterling, who's screaming hand. Foden. Making mischief, Phil Foden. He said it's a, a perfectly logical one. James's arm was very close. Jorginho. Now to check his run. Role that we all expected him to take at the start of the game. He's there now. Harried by Jesus, who is uh, fresh. Christensen. It's Phil Foden, it's Riyad Mahrez, it's lifted away almost from beneath his own bar by Azpilicueta. Fed Mahrez. He can play in, Christian Pulisic! Who was... Kept it from Rudiger. Foden delivers, Azpilicueta clear. Sweet turn from Riyad Mahrez. Who... Fernandinho.